Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, The Key Is Me, and I am back again with another video. Now, y'all gonna have to excuse my voice because I went too hard for homecoming. If you didn't know, I graduated from FAMU, and we just celebrated our homecoming, so I'm trying to catch my voice back, y'all. I had a blast. But I'm going to be doing a review video on this hair that I received from Numer Hair. I believe I am saying that right. I have in some of their Brazilian curly hair. This hair is already constructed in a wig. I love the way that they gave you packaging that came in a box as well as in a bag. So y'all know how I feel about when you're able to restore the hair in your closet. So it did come in a little bag for you to keep the hair in. Now, I do believe that it was pre-pluck hairline. It comes with three combs in the two combs on the side, one in the front and one in the back, as well as an elastic band. I did go ahead and wash and condition the hair off camera to get the smell out of it, and this is what the hair looks like straight from washing. So like I said before, this is a pre-pluck hairline. I did not pluck the hairline at all. So here I'm just going to take some of my foam. You can kind of use any foam that you have, any styling foam that you have. And I'm going to go ahead and lay my edges down. Now what I do is I take the styling foam to wet the hair and then I take some either some Eco Styler Gel or some Gots To Be Glue to actually secure the baby hair. I did go ahead and let the baby hairs dry before I moved on to putting the wig on. So here I'm going to take a stocking cap and I'm going to use I'm going to use my Gots to Be Free spray and I'm just going I'm going to spray the free spray around my hairline and that is going to secure the cap in place. So when I get ready to cut it, it will be it will fit the shape of my head. And I'm going to use a blow dryer on cool and I'm going to dry that. And then I just take some scissors and I just cut it to where I put the spray. And as you can see, it won't come up. So you'll know exactly where to cut it and foundation with my foundation brush. And I just went ahead and put that on the cap to blend it in with my skin tone. Now I am going to put the wig on to see how it is looking and y'all, when I tell y'all, I was so excited putting this on. This is the first time I've ever had a frontal look like this. Like I'm still shocked that I did it. Like did I do that or what? Somebody let me know down in the comment section. But I'm just going to go ahead and take my scissors and I'm going to cut around the edges. And then from there, you're going to see me take my Gots To Be Glue and I'm going to secure it down. And I'm going to put my stocking cap over it and I'm, I'm then going to put my scarf over it and I'm going to let it dry for about 15 minutes.
y'all. <laughs> Just look at my reaction taking this off. Your girl did that, okay? Practice, practice, practice. That's all I can say is just keep practicing. It may not be as flawless as others, but I did that. And that's all that matters. So now I'm going to take some of my powder and I'm just going to blend in the lace with my skin tone. So I'm taking my Laura Mercier powder and this is a translucent powder that I use for my face every day. And I'm going to go ahead and define the parting as well with the powder. As you can see, I had to put my glasses on to make sure I'm seeing what I need to see. Make sure I'm seeing correctly because, you know, I was shocked. And this is the final look. The only thing that I don't like about the parting area, as you can see, it's a little bit too plucked in that area where the part is but again I did not pluck any of this it came pre-plucked already so that was one of the cons I have for this hair other than that this hair is extremely curly it's extremely soft the only thing that I did to the hair was I went ahead and I put some water some leave-in conditioner and some mousse and I was good to go. I'm definitely going to put all of the products down in the information section below. I'm also going to put all of the details for this wig down below in the comment section. So you can grab all of that of these wigs. Absolutely loving it. Y'all know I love my curly hair. So thank you so much for tuning into this video. If you could please like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I look forward to seeing my next video.